just fucking kill me. Oh guys, today guys, I'm doing a, I'm tackling a commentary on Future Blood, on his commentary on Sean Samson. Just, why? Please enjoy. Just, why would he do a commentary on, on, on this guy? Because I have the right to criticize him. I mean, you know, Sean does need improvement, though. And I'm also going to be skipping his intro. Because his intro is too long. Too long. Dude, the intro is 12 seconds, and it's not really that long. I mean, what the fuck? Hello guys, this is Future Blood, back with another commentary. Now, I got off from vacation, and my vacation is over, so I finally get to make more commentaries. So today, I am going to be doing another commentary on Sean Sampson. Oh boy, what have he done this time? Basically, he made a commentary on Death Critic's commentary on him. Aw, isn't someone but Hulk? Future Blood, you're not funny. At all. Okay, can you explain why I'm not funny? No? Okay, just continue on with the video. Anyways, without further ado, let's get started. It's a big pain I have to do this. See, dude? This is why you, cop you copied off from Troll Socks. What the fuck does Troll Suck have to do with anything? This come the guy who cannot make his voice sound make make his voice sound clearer. Well, maybe it's because I can't even control how I sound, dude. If you keep your immaturity up, you might be Leafy Green Productions. Wow, I am back from the dead, people. Hey guys, Death Critic here, and welcome to Return of the Commentary video by Sexy Black Lady. Never say that ever again, Death Critic. Oh my god, who the hell cares? What you just said is one of the most insanely idiotic things I have ever heard. Oh, okay, Halo fan. Well, guess what? That is what you think, just because you're getting so pissed because I am criticizing your favorite YouTuber. Wow, people really miss me so much. It's Well, it's good to be back here in YouTube right now. It's good to be back. It's been a long time, isn't it? So since I'm back, today I'll be doing a commentary video on Sean Sampson, who made a commentary video on Ryan Rhino Mills over Blue Flame. 3500. Actually, dude, it's not. That's not the avatar that Ryan used in this particular video. Yeah, he used this picture before he started using his own avatar. Do you know what you're doing? You're nitpicking. Just like this guy. Great job, kid! Sean Samson was not white. Uh, Sean Samson was not. Going off topic, and by the way, Sean says he was not nitpicking. Actually, he was nitpicking. He was just bitching about Death Critic not using the right picture. This video is kind of short and is really bad. So let's see how bad he did this time. You know, dude, if you want to say that the video is terrible, wait until the end of the video to explain your thoughts on the video, instead of saying it right now. Sean, my advice to you, stop bossing people around. It doesn't matter when Death Critic says if it's terrible or not at the beginning or at the end, whatever, because it doesn't freaking matter. Yes, it does matter. No, it doesn't, because there are no rules of making a commentary. Without further ado, let's get started. <laughs> hey, I'm a dick. So, what was the point of that joke? 
all you did was shown one of your emails and um then you're you're saying that you're a D. Just why did you use that joke? Was he trying to be funny? Isn't it what purpose of his video is trying to be funny and being entertaining in his commentary videos? Why did I take this seriously? Uh dude, I wasn't taking the joke seriously. Only in the video Don't you dare play that clip. I'll skip it, I'll fast forward it. <laughs> so what was the point of that joke? You know, dude, Death Critic is right. You were taking a joke right too seriously. You know, are you just lying? Or you just wanted to get away with it? First off, he was not lying. Second off, What you just said is one of the most insanely idiotic things I have ever heard. First off, Sean Sampson was lying. Second off, I didn't even say any idiotic things. I just showed proof that Sean Sampson was taking the joke way too seriously. You just speed the video up just to make me look bad because you want to defend your precious YouTube ball. Dude, you really come off as a tryhard. Yes, you guys aren't seeing things. I'm doing a two shot on Rhino Mills. Yaw. Please don't use that because that is not that is not pleasant to the ear. I mean, seriously, you used it at the beginning of the video, and you used it when Blue Flame sir said, "Yes, you guys aren't seeing things. I'm doing a two shot on Rhino Mills." Yaw. Have you heard of skipping before? No. Oh well, I'm sure you'll learn your lesson in the future. Learned what lesson? Are you serious, dude? I mean, explaining what is that? Um, this is the lesson he was talking about. Don't play that clip once again. <sighs> My God. Dude, I was just trying to help Sean realize what Death Critic is talking about. Skipping. Ryan Rhino Mills is just skipping. Do you not know how to pay attention, Sean? No? Yes, yes, he was paying attention to the video. Yeah, you Are you paying attention to the video? Of course I was paying attention to the video. Are you paying attention to the video? Oh yeah, and if this is going to be another chain video, I will chainsaw your legs off. Yeah, that does make you a hypocrite. First of all, how is he being a hypocrite? Rhino Mills was just giving an explanation of how generic it is when Sonic Orbit argued Bieber Fanatic 123? You're seriously gonna do a commentary on them? I don't see any valid point of your argument over Rhino Mills about his cliché and generic points. I mean, I don't mean to be Mr. Cliché here, but pay attention! Also, he was just making an explanation that not to be Mr. Cliché here, he's just giving a little advice. That doesn't make him a hypocrite, alright? Okay, dude. I said that it makes him a hypocrite because he was getting on orbit for saying something generic, and yet in the same video he used a cliché. Like Blue Flame said, the words do mean unoriginality. How in the living shit is paraphrasing what Blue Flame 3500 said criticizes Rhino's argument? You know, it's kind of funny because you're saying that you tell, you tell him to explain either way, you don't explain yourself. I love it how you criticized me for not explaining, which I already did, and yet you don't really explain anything in this video. <laughs> And that's where the video ends. Overall, this commentary video by Sean Sampson was terrible. He didn't even pay attention to any of his arguments claim over Ryan and Rhino Mills. Also, he's slightly defending Blue Flame 3500, which is weird because he did some mistakes throughout his two-shot video over Rhino Mills. Also, just want to give you a big note here. Sean Sampson made a commentary video on it that is four months old. Yes. The video is four months old, but at least I'm not commentating on a dead topic. 
What's your point? Death Critic's point is that commenting on a month old video is completely pointless. And I First off, how? Because Sean can't bring anything new to the table. So yeah, that's the reason why. I can tell most of his commentary videos that were dead topic. You know what? I'm going to stop the video right there. Because I want to bring up this point. I didn't commentate on videos that were dead topics. So you're saying that you didn't commentate on videos that were dead topics, even though you commentated on me and Carlos Five, the Uncle Hamill, and Cool Your Swag's old video. Excuse me for a second. First off, dude, he has not done commentaries on old videos. Yes, he did. He commentated on a junior fan video that was four years ago. He commentated on a manic video from three years ago. He commentated on a video from the Uncle Hammer, which was two years ago. And he commentated on a Most Hated Stuff video that is one year old. Seriously, we are like in... 2015, and people are still bitching about most hate stuff. Of course you did, you liar! Wong, 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 wong. Wong, 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 wong. wong. You wong, you wong, you wong. Just like what Serious Hedgehog Co. says, overused jokes are overused. Anyways, I'm just gonna end the video right here, which this video that Sean made was just bleeding. <sighs> this commentary is just horrible. In fact, this guy, Sean Sampson, is just lying, and he's just ignorant, and he's a fanboy of mine, Ben the Looney, Blue Flame 4500, and Illini guy. Go check out one of his commentaries if you know what I mean. Sean Sampson, if you're watching this, I, all I had to say, you suck at making commentaries. Really, you, you really just suck at them. My advice to you, Sean, please get off YouTube for five years, and you can just, you know, be, you know, a better commentator. And also, stop being ignorant towards Blue Flame 3500. You're becoming more worse. No, he's not. He's, he's getting, he's got, he got better. More worse and even more worse as Dark Sonic 297. Seriously, you have to bring a Dark Sonic 297? He's an old topic. And yes, I do know Sean Susan just commentates on old topics, which he doesn't. Anyways, this has been my commentary. I hope you guys enjoyed this, and thank you for watching. What you just said is one of the Fuck this video clip. I'm gonna skip it. So, yep, yeah, that's the end of the video. Overall, this video is freaking terrible. So, guys, stop doing contests in Sean Sampson, or else you will die of a slowly and painful death. So, what you're saying is, if I do more commentaries on Sean Sampson, you might kill me? Well, that is the other problem I have with this video, because, one, you don't know where I live, two, you're not allowed to kill people, because you might go to jail for that. Anyways, I'm just going to end the video right here. So, yeah, what do I think about Halo Fan? Well... He's just a shit commentator that can't even improve.